have just released 96 rated Renato Sanchez for an 88 and an 87 rated squad. Oh, lovely. Five star skills, four star weak foot. Nice. High, high with insane in games. Almost 90 Raja 9 goal in game. Yeah, I'd say so. The defending is 89, but every other stat is in the 90s. Great traits. Wow. Let's see if he lives up to the hype and let's see if he's as good as every other Renato Sanchez card has been for the past couple years. Hey, let's go. Here he is on the ball and I can say right away he feels super fast. This guy is going to get so many interceptions and just cre oh, oh, already, already almost gets his first tackle. Renato, Renato, Renato plays him through. Finish a joke. Oh, <laughs> To pick him out there, that's the vision. That's the vision, boys. Is he the best center in the in the game? Give me that! Give me that! No, 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 Next game. Well, that last game was a bit awkward, boys, but we are back in business. Renato Sanchez on the ball. Can he score? No. Oh, yeah! Vamos! Five-star skills in this guy just makes him different. Makes him different, bro. Oh, my God. We're back on. We're back on. Skill moves. Vamos, we have to go. Move. Move body. You want to hold that? You want to hold that? You, you, you right there. You want to hold that? Yes. 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 Renato Sanchez. The defending may may not be in the 90s, but it is still good enough. Who would have thought? Not me. Ah, go! Go, Renato. Go. The pen. Very false. Oh, ref. Why? I don't know, Jeff. I think you guys. I think. I think you guys. Oh, my days. I think you guys should do this card. You're joking. I think you guys should do that card. Did you just see what he did? Did you see what he did right there? The passion. No. There's a lot of good box to box midfielders in this game, but very few are going to have the animations and the control that this Renato Sanchez ca card has. Bombing forward. He's bombing forward. Let's go. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Finish that near post. What happens when you move your keeper? What happens? Let me tell you what happens. You lose, you lose, you lose. Vamos! Chem style for this card is going to depend on where you play him. If you play him as a CDM or a holding midfielder, I'm gonna have to go with Shadow. That has got to be the chem style. Get the sprint speed and the acceleration to 99 wall. Also, get into defensive stats into the high 90s. If you're playing him in a box to box, he's gonna be attacking more. He's gonna be on the ball. Maybe getting a little bit more shots on goal. I would have to go with a Hunter to, again, get the pace up and then the finishing. All the other shooting stats are pretty good, except for the finishing, 88. So I didn't have too many problems with that in this in this little segment of games that I did. But that can become an issue down the road. 99 shot power is incredible. It's really good. Same with the positioning, attack positioning from a, for a midfielder. Positioning is everything. And that's how he's going to get goals for you guys. Just flying up from the middle of the park going running into the box out of a deep lying position he is going to get so many goals also got a good long shot so that is key if you're just feeling feeling a bit cheeky and you want to let one rip he can deliver passing wise 98 short passing 96 long passing those are the two most important stats for central midfielders and i would say central players in general and they are both insane both almost at the max the max they can be also vision is good curve not so much but curve and crossing aren't, aren't too too important for a again a central player those sort of longer passing curve cross sort of guys are aren't as important and then the dribbling this is where you're gonna make your make your goals this is where you're gonna get your bang for your buck the dribbling 98 with agility 99 balance with 98 dribbling 98 composure and 97 ball control perfect 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 dribbling stats for the guy i touched i, I talked about the defending a bit earlier but 
The biggest stat that stands out is the heading accuracy that's bringing the overall stat down a bit. So it's it's not that bad. It's not the 76 is bringing the average down. But if you look at all the other stats, they're 93 interceptions, 90 defensive awareness, 91 standing tackle. So they're, it's pretty much in the 90s. I would say sliding tackle and heading accuracy aren't super important for a car like this, especially someone at his height, which is 5'9". It's going to help the dribbling, the height a lot. The height body type dribbling it all goes hand in hand to make him one of the best dribbling and creative midfielders we have in the game on to the physical though 95 jumping 98 stamina 94 strength and 95 aggression he is small but he can put up a fight both attacking and defending he is he, he has a strength to go toe to toe with say like a bigger midfielder like a kimpembe here who is 6'2 and has crazy strength and aggression he can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with him. He has the animations and the traits to go in and cause damage against these bigger, more physical players. Speaking of the traits, though, he has flair, long shot taker, speed dribbler, out to the foot shot, flair passer, and technical dribbler. Flair passes may get some of you in trouble because of all the just just trying to do too much too much skill skills can get you in trouble in your own third but you know it's all about the fun it's all about the fun and that is what the flare passes straight is gonna give you also out to the foot shot and long shot taker combined are great together this guy has some of the best traits in the game and that's why he is always such an annoying card to play because you feel like he just has an upper hand and he does he has an upper hand with the traits if you take a look at some of the other midfielders in my team lucas paqueta is another one like that he has great traits but not not even close to what ronato has he has so many more traits so much better animations than a lot of these cards he's on par with as a dam with the amount of traits he has almost has that second page but there isn't any bad trait i would say there's no like chip shot or lead team leader or solid player or injury prone there's no useless trait all these traits are super useful and super impactful to his animations and the links you're gonna get great links obviously uh portuguese nationality and then psg the new psg transfer is gonna strong link with kimpembe marquinhos joe cole and then obviously the likes of Messi, Neymar, Mbappe, and then also some other boys. I, I don't think I, that's most of the PSG players in this game, but there obviously are some other ones. Obviously the Ginola, but I don't think a lot of you guys, Ben Yedder, he's gonna strong link with. Uh, as I said, Mbappe, Neymar, Messi, those are just obviously, obviously great cards. Di Maria, end of era, that's, that's another one right there that I like. Strong links with Jelson Martins as well. Sergio Ramos, it is just a great, great card. But if you guys enjoy the Video, leave a like subscribe and i'll see you guys next time peace